you live in Guyana, I'm pretty sure you go to the marketplace and the supermarket. From your own experience, are the prices that you are facing justified? Again, I don't know if I can answer that the prices are justified. I don't tend to look at prices, especially prices of food that way. I don't purchase what I can't afford, I guess. But I also try to look for alternatives. Mm -hmm. And one of the things that I have found, especially this year with COVID, um, is that I have been finding a good variety of alternatives available in Guyana, a good variety of healthy alternatives available in Guyana. The Food and Agriculture Organization's latest report on the Food Price Index reports that food prices rose by just over 28%. The rise in food prices in 2021 is on top of increases experienced in 2020. Why are prices going up? Why is it even happening? <laughs> well, what that means is what I think many of us already know when we put our hands in our pockets at the supermarket, or at the markets, mm -hmm. we feel it. We are paying more money. We're paying more money for food. Right. So why is that is I think the question that you originally oh, asked a while right. ago. And really, the, the, it's a little bit complex. So essentially, there are a lot of factors that contribute to changing food prices on this global index. Mm -hmm. um, and these factors interact with one another in fairly complex ways. But there are a couple of things that we know, and I think many people will, will understand, gravitate to. One of the things that, that changes prices of food is demand. Will the prices come down and what will it take for that to happen? So I can't answer you whether prices will come down or not. Right. I don't know whether prices will come down. I know as a consumer that I feel pretty much the same way, that prices always seem to go in one direction and they don't seem to go down. I think, though, that there is evidence that prices do go down. Dr. Smith believes Guyana needs to continue to implement its mix of measures. In the short term, she commended and recommended that the government continue as important its social protection measures. Another thing Guyana has been doing in the short term is to offer relief and support to food producers like farmers and fishermen. Meanwhile, Dr. Smith said that Guyanese exporters can take advantage of the high prices. She recognized that those prices on the global market, set by several complex factors, can fluctuate in the future. For the newsroom, Kurt Campbell.